you could have, Eric, an army of an animal, one animal but an army of it, to take over the world, what would that animal be and why? Oh, brother, what kind of question is that? <laughs> if you could have an army of any animal, what would it be and why? Oh, gosh. Well, I like dogs. Monkeys. Cats. Bats. Rats. Large cats. Bats, of course. They are mammals. Tigers. Tigers, leopards, black panthers, penguins. <laughs> penguins, that'd be so awesome. Penguins. Cutest army, cutest army. What about the lynx? You can't find for like your northern territories. Rats, because I already own 12. So you already pretty much have an army of, of rats. Yeah. Oh, I just love that. I love. I keep a little bat I have that is in a jar up on my shelf. He's so cute. She has a bat in a jar. If you multiply that by like a billion, then you'd have 12 billion, let's do the math, I think it's 12 billion rats, right? 12 times a billion? So would you have an army of dogs that could take, like you take over the world with this army, would you choose dogs? I'd probably give them machine guns and just tell them to make sure that our streets stay crime free. Well done, well done, good answer. 50 foot ants. What a good animal, 50 foot ants. Orangutans. Good choice, they have really good arm strength. I think little monkeys with the darling little hats on and then they of course have to have a diaper but then they can help me clean house. They can tidy up a bit. You know those little helper monkeys. Monkeys, eh? Why monkeys? Because they're so cute and furry and you think they're not gonna cause harm, but they can. My question is this. If you have monkeys with diapers, how will they get to the poo to throw it? Oh, they wouldn't throw poo. They would be very well trained. Oh, they, isn't that like the most, the strongest thing about having an army of monkeys that they can throw poo at each other? That's what I think. I think army of monkeys, I'm like, oh my God, we're gonna get covered in poo.